All right, hey everybody, I'm finally getting back to Assassin's Creed 3. So yeah, um, I checked when the last part was uploaded, and it was fucking November. Like, what? It's been that long? Yeah, if you're, if you're watching this years from now, that won't matter, but yeah. So, let me... Let me see about something really quick, if I can find it. Because there is a thing that I have been missing for this entire playthrough. And I need to get to it. Uh, nope. Counting book. Eh. That wasn't what I needed to do. I think I need to go... I actually need to go down. To access this, but... Yeah. Because, I mean, uh, for some of the DLC and some of the Uplay uh, Passport, or U Ubisoft Passport, as, as they used to call it, uh, exclusive stuff that part of it was free, part of it I had to pay some of the points I had gotten by playing some of the Ubisoft games that I have played, um, and, you, and got to earn those points for. I have access to different outfits, and I can also build up my armor, and whatever else. I just... How do I get down to it, is the question. Hold on. Uh... It's downstairs, and I'm not seeing a set of stairs to go down. Uh, and the only place to do this is in the manor, so... Yeah. Let me actually go to my history because I actually watched a video a bit ago about this. Fits an armory. Here we go. Okay, okay. Yeah, I just didn't remember. I, could, I just didn't know I could do that after the armory was introduced in this game. Otherwise, I would have gone to it. Because in Asa the Assassin's Creed games prior to this one, um, they had merchants upgrade your, uh, your armor and whatever else. So here we go with some of the alternate outfits. Captain of the Aquilas uniform. Traditional colonial assassin outfit, prisoner outfit, Ezio's outfit. There we go. Uh, 
And this is really cool, just to have this. I like Ezio's outfit. I kind of like Altair's outfit, but I like Ezio's more. Pirate Flintlock. Scottish Flintlock. Hmm. Just the regular Flintlock was awful. Is there another? No, there wasn't. Snares. Rope darts. Stone tomahawk. Was there a different tomahawk? No, there was not. Pirate boarding axe. Awesome. I uh, should probably switch back to his uh, regular outfit. Oh yeah, but I am now playing this on the Xbox One X, which I got in between the last couple parts, which means this game is now running at a consistent uh, 60 FPS, or no, 30 FPS, rather than 60. And, um, it, uh... Eh, while it has probably better performance through that, because they did that same thing for, um... Because they did the same thing for, uh, um, is it Assassin's Creed Rogue Remastered? Um, I do hate the fact that it doesn't, like, they didn't add a toggle for it. You know. And while I'm happy that they wanted to go with it, uh, my question is why couldn't they just have added a toggle to it? And it's only on the Xbox One X version, as far as I know. Uh, the Xbox, the regular Xbox One version, and the Xbox 360 still run at the uncapped frame rate, so I don't get it. Uh, so, I believe this is sequence 10 right now. Hold on. Maybe, yep. Yeah, it's nice to get back to a game that I started a while ago. Did always mean to come back to it, I just... First I was playing other games, then my computers crack, or my computers shit the bed, then uh, other stuff. Yeah. Um, that was the main thing right there about that. Let's see. Wait, how, hold on. Can I... Yeah, I can fast travel to there. Good.
you gotta love how in prior games you needed to hold down both the run button and A to run faster. But in this in this game, they made it just one button. Hold on, how the hell do I call a horse? Oh yeah, before I really started this game up, I, uh... I, um, I tried to start it up when I was at the main menu, and because I hadn't played it on the Xbox One X prior to this uh, recording, I, um, it said for some reason that I didn't have a certain DLC that it needed, like it was required DLC is what it said. I'm assuming that's f maybe for the ending, but I always thought that any DLC missions for this game were just stuff that takes place after this, maybe in an alternate history context. Uh, I could be wrong, but I thought that's what it was. Yeah, and that was weird. Um, though maybe it was the cosmetics that I, um... That I had uh, from the Uplay uh, passport thing. Now called uh, Uplay. Or whatever the hell that it was called. You know. Yeah. I, I just don't get why they didn't have a toggle option. You know? Because, yes. Uh... Oh, another elk. I'm just... I'm just gonna ignore him, because I need to get on with the story. again. hate the way that this works. Here we go. I really like the fact that I have all these different weapons. It's really cool. Wow. Awesome.
But yeah, I also do plan on uh, playing the Assassin's Creed games that take place after this one. And, uh... Yeah. Maybe not as quickly as I played through Assassin's Creed 1 through Brotherhood and the first... Anything. We'll take anything you can offer us. Take anything you can offer. Fucking Irishman. But yeah. Uh, like, after this, I do plan to play through Assassin's Creed 4, then Rogue Remastered. Um, I could try to play through the original Rogue if anyone wants me to. But I just, I'd rather have the remastered version, which, as far as I know, is just basically a straight up port of the. PC release, I believe, of Rogue, if that was released to PC. Either that or just an upscaled release of um, the original Rogue. But yeah. Um, and then it would be Syndicate and Unity? I don't know if it, that's the exact order, but I do have them listed right. Uh on my uh xbox when because they they gave you the they give you the group option or they gave us it in one of the latest updates for the console which is really cool well yeah for the xbox one in general which in all honesty was really cool so yeah don't want to crash into some red coats i don't want trouble don't need trouble either Holy shit, some of these NPCs are just disappearing. What the hell? Ah, glitches. Holy crap, you, you're, you guys are seeing that. Elgato's capturing everything I'm seeing. planning if we're to put an end to this i've tried but the soldiers themselves are told nothing now only to await orders from above keep digging come find me when you have something worth sharing mm, we're so close to victory a few more well-placed attacks and we'll be able to put an end to the civil war and be rid of the crown what do you intend well nothing at the moment since we're completely in the dark i thought the templars had eyes and ears everywhere oh we did until you started cutting them off. Your contact said orders from above. It tells us exactly what we need to do. Track down the Loyalist commanders. Yeah. Not what I'm gonna do, but whatever. God damn it. Oh yeah, Haytham uh, appears in Rogue at some point. I know that I've seen some cutscenes footage from it. surprised that they gave Rogue a technically remastered version on current consoles, but not the first Assassin's Creed or 3. Like, I'm surprised that they didn't release a 3-pack um, of the games. You know? 
You'd think that would be the next logical Have step after the Ezio trilogy to reinforce getting remapped. Yeah, it's technically remastered and uh, really re-released on current consoles. Yet if we do not join with them, they risk defeat. And then what? Yeah, well, they should have come I, by think, I think Assassin's Creed 1 Talking could definitely circles. use the, uh, well, the upgrade in the... Uh, and what do you propose we do? March in what do you call them? The, um... Well, yes. The graphics. Ah! Ambush! Connor? Little help here? Leave the commanders alive, Connor. We can interrogate them. Oh, yes. I love having these things, finally. Oh, shit. I know for most of the story thus far, we haven't had them. They're sucked ass, because these things are a staple. Don't like. Apparently, they changed them for Origins in a way that doesn't make any sense. But yeah. We'll bring them back to my quarters at Fort George and see what secrets they might share. <sighs> really? Yes. Well, you'd best get off from them. You go. I will watch the prisoners. No, you do it. Why me? Because I said so. Now go! There we go. Move. Go to hell. I said move. I don't know Wait, what the point of that even was. I'll tell you anything you want. Anything. Only don't make We just have some there. questions for you. Cross that threshold and I'm a dead man. There you are, Connor. I was worried you might have gotten lost. Come on, Ben. Okay. For some reason, I'm only walking slightly faster than the NPC, but at least that's better than nothing. Like, seriously, if you're gonna have, like, escort missions or whatever else, have the NPCs, like, actually move at a decent pace, or make your- make the player move slower. Because, honestly, it's just too stupid to do, like, some of these games do. I feel like that these games render in real time, though. What for are their, the British planning? For their cutscenes. To march from Philadelphia. That city's finished. New York's the key. They'll double our numbers, push back the rebels. When do they begin? Two days from now. June 18th. I must warn Washington. You see? That wasn't so very difficult now, was it? I I've told you everything. Now let me go. Of course. The other two said the same. It must be true. You killed him. You killed all of them. Why? They'd have warned the loyalists. You could have held them until the fight was done. What? And with precious time and money on their care? What would be the point? They'd given up everything they knew. I'll meet you at Valley Forge. 
summer sun has beaten you into the shade with an elephant first reach for Tedman's gooseberry tonic and restart. Mm. So you guys can probably tell I don't give two shits about um support the community. St. Mary's will be raising funds to repair like storm damage to the steeple. God blesses all dutiful citizens. Has your Pippin thrown a shoe? Need your tack adjusted? Collins Barriers of Needle Street is the place to go. I could have just fast traveled. Would have saved a lot of time. Probably because I stole this horse, that's probably why. Let me, uh, let me try to do that. <laughs> Just get the fuck out of here. Uh... I should have probably kept the horse. too far away from it, but just, yes. Really can't. Okay, then. Here. 
All right, horse. Here we go. Kinda wonder why they haven't made a Western title for this series yet. And again, you also wonder why they haven't set one of these in Japan, even though everyone asked them to, and it would be awesome. set one of the uh, side games in China. Yeah, China. Remember, Assassin's Creed China. I technically have those 2D sides crawling Assassin's Creed games because at different points they were available for free for games with gold and it's just like, I bet they were because no one cares. I should say no one cares that much. One game that I still need to get for this series is, um, Liberation. Which, now that it's backwards compatible, it honestly will probably be worth it. If, it's, if it ever goes on a sale, I should definitely get it. Um, because I think it's an expansion to this, essentially. But it's like, uh, it's like Far Cry 3 Blood Dragon, where they, um, it's an expansion... But, um, it's also technically its own separate game. Also, like, Uncharted The Lost Legacy, where it's technically... It was built as an expansion to Uncharted 4. But, technically, it, and technically it is its own game, but it's more of a spin-off than anything, because it only has non-Nathan Drake characters in it. Which I'm not against. If you watch my playthrough that, I actually had a fun time with it. It's just, you know, makes sense why it's a separate title. Oh, am I hitting... Is this a fort? Yeah, it's a fort. Ah. It's a Patriot fort. Cool. With, I'm assuming, some of the, uh... The, uh, the natives. Alright, gonna leave you here, horsey. This is gonna be some shit. Why are you following me, horse? Why are you German? Right, right, since I'm not... Ah, uh, the horse is following me. Okay, horse, come on. What the hell? Wow, I didn't realize that that would happen. I'm wearing headphones, and they're jacked into my uh, my controller so that I can turn the TV down so that the sound doesn't get caught in my microphone for my audio. And I didn't realize that the mic on it was on. We should so, be sharing what we know with Lee, not Washington. Cortana you thought that that's him, what I But my enemy do. is a notion, not a nation. It is wrong to compel obedience, whether to the British crown or the Templar cross. And I hope in time the loyalists will see this too, for they are also victims. You oppose tyranny, injustice. These are just symptoms. Their true cause is human weakness. Why do you think I keep on trying to show you the error of your way? You have said much, yes, but you have shown me nothing. Then we'll have to remedy that, then, won't we? Maybe. Sir. Hello, Connor. What brings you here? 
The British have recalled their men in Philadelphia. They march for New York. Very well. I'll move our forces to Monmouth. If we can rout them, we'll have finally turned the tide. And what's this? Private correspondent. Oh, of course it is. Would you like to know what it says, Colin? It seems your good friend here has just ordered an attack on your village. Although attack might be putting it mildly. Well, tell him, Commander. We've been receiving reports of Allied natives working with the British. I've asked my men to put a stop to it. By burning their villages and salting the land, by calling for their extermination, according to this letter. Not the first time, either. Tell them what you did 14 years ago. That was another time. The Seven Years' War. And so now you see what happens to this great man when under duress. He makes excuses, displaces blame, does a great many things, in fact, except take responsibility! Enough! Who did what and why must wait. My people come first. Then let's be off. No. You and I are finished. Son. Do you think me so soft that by calling me son, I might change my mind? How long did you sit on this information, or am I to believe you discovered it now? My mother's blood may stain another's hands, but Charles Lee is no less a monster, and all he does, he does by your command. A warning to you both. Choose to follow me or oppose me, and I will kill you. Start everything. I think. Damn it. So slow.
mind you, game. It's because I lost the fucking horse. Probably start this. I'll just ignore everybody I come across. Horse. I'm gonna go back and kill that other guy. So there's only three squads on my thing. Fucking damn it. Got it done. Where are you, horse? Great, the horse just despawned. Fuck. do this because it's just like I hate what the fuck is this mission called broken trust I'm gonna pause here, guys.